Great story there. Thanks for being with us, everyone, and welcome here to ABC Action News at 530. I'm Paula Grohl, and happening right now, school districts across the Tampa Bay area are now rushing to hire nurses with just days before students go back to class. Tonight, Sarah Hollenbeck here digging deeper on this one, finding out how a nationwide shortage is causing delays here. I can't wait to see the kids when they show up. Catherine Burge loves her career. She's about to start her 15th year as a school nurse. For me is one of the greatest gifts is to be able to see how the children grow. But for school districts nationwide, finding qualified nurses has never been tougher. It's been a variety of obstacles we've run into. Sarah O'Toole in Pinellas County's School Health Services Department says nurses are in high demand and school districts are constantly competing against hospitals for staff. People can go work um, in a hospital and make a lot more money, so that's always been a challenge for us. Hillsborough, Polk, and Pinellas counties all plan to have a dedicated full-time LPN in each school this year. Hillsborough still needs to hire 32 nurses, Pinellas 15, and Polk 6. Yet all three districts say they're relying on staffing agencies to fill in the gaps so that no school goes uncovered. O'Toole hopes the flexibility will lure more nurses to choose schools. It's no nights, no weekends, and no holidays, which is always a bonus. Burge knows this year will be her most challenging, but says she's honored to play a role in slowing the spread of COVID-19. It is one of the most rewarding jobs out there. Sarah Hollenbeck, ABC Action News.